Arsenal, my Arsenal, my story. You had a, a relationship, a working relationship, as well as a, a friendship with David mm. Dean that, that has lasted a, a long time. Um, how did you cope with when he left, and, and what, what effect did that have on the club? I, uh, I was for a while uh, really disturbed because, you know, uh, as you said, it's always difficult to be a friend with somebody uh, as we are and uh, work together because sometimes it could have a negative impact as well. But on, in our case, it was really, we could work together uh, like uh, uh, we didn't even need to speak, you know. And uh, when he left, for me, it was a very difficult period. And in fact, I, I had a, a real hard time because I was torn in between going as well and, uh, and uh, being faithful uh, to our friendship, and it's David who asked me to stay at the club at that time. And uh, that's why I decided to stay. And uh, overall, uh, I had a very difficult period that summer. I was not well at all, and uh, uh, I suffered a lot on, uh, during that period. And after that, of course, I find a new way to work and a new way to once the season has started again, you focus on uh, your team and uh, the, the championships and the winning games. But was, he, was he ever really replaced? Look, uh, he was never really replaced because after that, uh, nobody from the board worked directly after. Uh, 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 Ken Fryer took over from him uh, again and uh, after that, uh, a few years later, uh, Ivan Gazidis took over from Ken Fryer. So, uh, uh, a guy who uh, was shareholder and uh, directly working with the, with the team didn't happen anymore.